All right, more breaking news tonight here. Do new details in the investigation of alleged Idaho murderer Brian Kohlberger. In newly unsealed search warrant records, authorities have detailed the items they seized from his residence after he was arrested and charged with the murders of four students. Comes nearly three weeks after Kohlberger was arrested at his parents' home in the Poconos. Action News reporter John Paul has been combing over the search warrant tonight. And John, what are you learning? Yeah, Rick, so we just got our hands on these search warrants. They were unsealed today in Washington, and they do reveal some more about the investigation that was unfolding behind the scenes. I'm going to walk you through some of the key pieces that I found in here. The documents show that it seemed to be his car, the white Hyundai Elantra, that may have helped them crack this case. It was seen on multiple different surveillance cameras in the area of the murders. Now, according to the warrants, Police checked for Elantras registered to students at Washington State University. Only one was found that was registered to Brian Koberger. Now from there, they obtained warrants for his phone and then for his apartment. Several items were seized, including a computer, hair strands and several items with dark stains, including a mattress cover. We also learned today that Koberger may have even sent direct messages on Instagram to one of the victims two weeks before the murders with things like, hey, how are you? Now, weeks ago, investigators did reveal they found a knife sheath near one of the bodies. They recovered a man's DNA from that, and that was later connected to Koberger through DNA found at his parents' home in the Poconos. It was raided December 29th, the same day that the uh, warrant was executed on his apartment itself. The other thing this warrant does say, it says these murders appeared to be have been uh, planned rather than a crime that happened in a moment of conflict. In the Satellite Center, John Paul, Channel 6 Action News. Shari. Yeah, prosecutors really laying out their case here. Yep. All right, John, thanks.